WTFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrial is trading down 175. NASDAQ up 58. S&P is down 10. Gold. Gold contract up $20, trading at 2000 546 an ounce. We have the silver contract uh, trading up 60 cents, $29.16 an ounce. Late sweet crude. Flat, $69.24 a barrel, notes and bonds. 10-year note, trading up 7 ticks at 114.24. The 30-year up 17 ticks at 125.23. And King Dollar. King Dollar is trading down 250, uh, 252 ticks, 101.106, euro 111, yen at 143 s uh pound at 131 to 1 us dollar now you know when you have corrections folks everything you know bottom line is surprises to the downside and that's exactly what we got out here today so if we take a look at the spy first okay what you're gonna see you know bottom line you know market's doing fine you know gets down to the bottom of the range rejects the bottom of the range and then all of a sudden let's loose again you know, so the spy traded up to 553, and then boom, we are at uh, 549. That's my take: is that, you know, this thing wants to get down and test the highs or the lows of the August 5th level, which is 523 to 510. We go into the NDX, the three Qs. What do you have? You have the exact same type of setup inside the three Qs. The NQs are up about 150, gave it up in spades, went down about 100. Now. We're basically up 15 bucks. That this is the building cause, folks, for lower price. That's my take on this thing. So, and the and on the Q situation, what you have is we are trading. Uh, you had a high today of uh, 465. You got a low of 457. We're trading 461. The high of the low is 442. The low is 423. We go over the gold contract. We take a look at gold. Gold got a bid today, but it doesn't have the volume behind it, man. The bottom line is it only has 143,000 contracts. I want to see 200,000 contracts. That's the bottom line. So we'll see how this shakes out again. It is in the higher range again. Once it got over 2537, that's the higher range once again. And then notes and bonds. They continue to want higher price. They broke out of the consolidation they were in. And let's see what, what the volume is on these today. So... Yeah, you get 101.9 million contracts. It's not bad. Stay right there, folks. Come right back. Consistency.